Alright guys, this is Freak. I'm going to uh, make a quick little video here to help out the people that are having some issues with the new version of Feedback, or any version, where they're saying that they're running the program, they do a couple hours of work, and then save it, but then when they go back they have to reopen, they have to re-download the program, open it up, and then their file's gone. Because Windows is kind of stupid in the way it handles zip files, this is understandable for the inexperienced computer user. But I'm going to clarify in what is happening and what you need to fix. So we're in here in Turkey Man's thread here. So look, oh wait, we've got a new version of feedback right there. All right, so I'm gonna left click that. And we got this window, it's gonna say, open with compressed folder, okay. So we'll say that, so we're gonna open now you get this this window here. This is inside the contents of the zip file. This is the part of Windows that is kind of stupid. What a lot of people are doing is going inside here. They're running the program from here. It will run, but as you will get this window, extract all, run, cancel. A lot of people are going to extract all because it's going to need all the files in the program. Now, the problem is that this is where it's you're seeing that it's getting rid of your file because it is saving it. If we go up here, up the folder, and click folders, well, where, where, where is this located? We've got documents and settings. Oh, it's in a temp file. It's a temp folder. It's not going to be there the next time you run the program. So therefore, your saved file will be gone. So we're inside the zip. We right click, go to copy. Okay. Now. Uh, this little scroll bar all the way to the top. This one at the bottom, all the way to the left. You're going to see local disk C, or whatever your C drive happens to be named. Click it. Now uh, you've got your folder, your C folder. Right click out here and click paste. There is your folder. And it's copied files. Okay. There's feedback. It is on C. It is not in a temp folder. Okay. Now you can run feedback. There we go. We have the feedback help. So I just close out of that and that. We've got no OGG. But I can save. So that's saved. And we close out of that. It's going to be in your C feedback. There, there you go. Feedback songs. That is where your chart will be saved, as long as you follow this process. You will not have any problems with losing your files if you do this. Alright? Okay.